Okay, here we go again to the Kepler tutorial. Welcome back. All right, today we're going to show you the um, how to create a harmonic chart or a vibration chart within the Kepler program. We are going to click on this icon, the 975 icon here. You click in here, you click on harmonic chart. In here, you can enter the number of harmonics or vibration charts that you want to create. The number one harmonic is actually the needle chart itself, so we will skip that. We have that already. So we're going to put, say, for example, 5, comma, space 7, comma, space 8, space 9. Okay, and then, or you, if you can just, if you just want 1, then you can just put 5, 7, 8, or 9. Okay? And then we click on OK. Oops, so we're going to put 7 in there, or 9. And then you click on OK. And then it created the uh, the uh, fifth harmonic chart first, because that's the first one that we created. Again, on the right side of the window is your shopping cart, so to speak. It lists everything that you are doing, or you have calculated charts on the top right side in here. And at the bottom here are the report selections that you created for the chart that is currently displayed on the screen. So we have the fifth harmonic in there. If you go to go down here, you, the next one is the seventh harmonic, and then the next one is the eighth harmonic, and then the ninth harmonic. It's very easy. It gets displayed on the left side immediately. Okay, so those are how to create a harmonic chart. Going back to the same icon though, Let's click on this. You can also create a harmonic chart, calculate for age, but you have to always go back to the needle chart to do that. And so we have to click in here. There are other functions in here, but I'm going to show you this harmonic chart, calculate for age. And then uh, you can enter the, uh, num the date that you want to start with, the number of consecutive charts that you want to use, and then you just click on OK, and that's it. You've got it. All right. Okay, that concludes our harmonic chart icon. So uh, I hope you enjoy it. I will show you on the next video. All right, take care. Bye for now.